The on him, it's so hard to count, you know, that's why I always say I don't want to be a judge, but he goes, wow. Zeffrino getting the take takedown, he goes good. right to the back. Got one hook, he's a little high. He's slipping it in. Trying to, trying he's slipping it in. Secure the neck. You can just see it here underneath. And it looks like it's there. It is, it's it. it. Is it. Wow, beautiful. Well, what goes to 16 fight. submissions for Zeffirino. Wow. 16. Once he took the back, Zeffirino made it stick. And the stoppage master continues, guys. He's got a heel look. He's not yep. going to be able to submit him from here, Todd, but he might do enough to get regain top position. So both men right now fishing for something high level jujitsu right now as they are continually looking. And Foster says, you know what? Forget the jujitsu. I'm just going to go to some punching. All Foster wants to do is get off the bottom, regain top position, or work their way back to a neutral standing position. I think he's going to succeed at this. I don't know if he wants to play the heel hook game here with Joao. Good shots here by Foster. Another good shot by Foster. Again, Foster just needs to scramble. Oh, and that's it. He went to the knee and locked it up. And unfortunately for Brian Foster, that is it. Brian went for this position, looking to get on top. He started to feel comfortable here and decided to stay too long. And as soon as Joao locked it up, my goodness, very dangerous position. Joao, excellent sportsmanship stopping. Brian Foster, very smart to tap out. And Joao, the dark horse, as wow. we talked about, has advanced in the tournament unscathed, Todd Harris. Early in round number one, and Brian Foster, he had the feeling all you have to do is have that hold put onto you one time. Lock put the pressure to the knee, and Foster had no choice to tap. But Foster gets new life because of the injury to Mike Ricci. He can't go, so Foster is in. And look at George Patino. How would it be if Patino, at 42 years of age, could come back and get a shot? But once again, Zeffarino going to the leg. This is a leg lock. He finished. Brian that, Foster that, that is it move. again. In the first what? round, Joao Zeffarino does it again. Wow. That is not easy to do. To submit George Patino is not something that I thought was likely to happen in that fight. That is the same technique that Zeffirino used earlier in the evening. For people just tuning in, Todd, we had we started with a quarterfinal. Now we are live, beginning at the semifinals. Yep. These guys have already fought once tonight. This is a very, very scary technique by Zeffirino. And apparently, he is very, very good at it because that's two for two in the last 60 minutes, Todd. This one. My, dear, my dear friend, my, my, my emotions are involved in this. I can't judge. I can't judge. Final 425 of this one between High and Zeffirino. As I mentioned, Lance Palmer, a featherweight champion, joining Henzo Gracie and myself. And a wow, big right coming that was a, from Zeffirino. A as he the fight and is that is it. The Joao Zeffirino has ended the fight, much to the displeasure of Jason High. Boom. Caught him with his hand down, right on the chin. Nice follow up. He got right on. Didn't give him any time. He was still fighting. He was still fighting. There's that was yeah. definitely early. And so but. sometimes we have trouble with referees that come from just striking concept. <laughs> Beautiful fight, Monster. <laughs> and right there, the referee sees Jason High's hands down. It almost looks like Lance High's yeah. left hand is pinned, so he can't get it out to defend himself. Bradley does a nice job pushing the hip, finding a way out. Get off that fence. He needs to start some offense of his own now, not wait and see what happens with Zeffirino. the distance, all working as Zeffirino's favor. Man, was I wrong. I thought that with his eight knockouts, I thought he was going to be the better striker. But Zeffirino, man, all over. 21 miles an hour that fist came at Bradley's head. Pretty amazing. Great combinations.
Yeah. Get ready. Uh huh. Listen. What you wanna do? If you don't strike first, that's when they gon' come at you. Yeah. And you know it's true. Don't let your life get worse. Being timid, that ain't cool. Nah, you gotta wake up. 